are back at the bridge. Mm. 748. Ready to get back on the trail. Yeah. So this is basically basically where we left off. We took a right into Duxbury or Jonesville. And today we're going left. We got a ride in from Snowflake Taxi. From Stowe. Yeah, from Stowe. And they're great. We've only had good experiences with Snowflake Taxi. Yeah. How do you feel? Well, our bag's heavy because this is our big leg. This is our six day leg. Uh, but otherwise, I feel well rested, strong, excited to get back on the trail. Yeah, I agree. I'm excited to get back out. Attention hikers, you are entering an active agricultural area. Electrified chicken and other livestock pens may be placed on the trail. Please go around the pen and continue on your way. So don't touch the fence. <laughs> <laughs> chickens. All right, so the trail goes this way, but we can't go that way because of the electric fence. So I thought we'd go through here, but the turkeys don't like it. <laughs> no one hikes the long trail alone. You're always with companions. Morning. The cows are cool, the turkeys are cool, the chickens are cool. Yeah, I don't know how cool they were when I was walking by though. No. The angry white dog was not cool. He just wanted to make friends, I think. Yeah. I'm out here alone tending to these chickens. <laughs> Welcome to Campbell's Hump State Park. Here we go. that both locks are closed before leaving the lodge. 
Yeah, did I take my... So this is the first shelter that has had a bear box that we've come across. Two boys awoke in a fright, with no clear end in sight. They lay in bed with thoughts in their heads to can the stupid height. <laughs> we're at some viewpoint. Oh no, it's Ethan Allen. Oh my gosh. Yay. We were going almost two miles an hour. Another mountain in the books. Yay. <clears throat> Mount yeah. Ethan Allen. No view, but that's okay. No view. It's... We lost at 7.15. 7.54. Awesome. We're doing great. Yeah. All right, onward, onward. <laughs> and downward. It's uh, 9.31, we're at Ladder Ravine. Looks like you can maybe find your footing to your, yeah. How was it? Um, it was kind of fun. Cool. A little scary, use the rope. Okay. <laughs> hey, look at that. We're actually getting a view right now. Like it's just starting to burn off. Well, that's the mountain we climbed. Can't be, you can't even see the top. Beautiful view. But holy crow. It's kind of a fall. So if this were wet, this would really not be fun. It's ability of thunderstorms later. Three-ish. According to Barry from camp. We just met, what was the hiker's name we met? Cobweb. Cob Cobweb or Cobwebs? Cobwebs maybe. Yeah, he's heading northbound. He said the Southern 100 is like a walk in the park. <laughs> we'll find out. Whew. It's cool, I put these little ladder things in. So different than other ladders we've seen. I like it. Here we go. Almost there. The Stark's Nest. Looks like it's starting to rain. Look, it's Cool Breeze's favorite. Ladders galore. Good job. Started with ladders and the day's gonna end with ladders. Oh, maybe this is called something. Howdy. So we're staying at the Stark's Nest, which is not an official shelter. We're like in a cloud right now, really misty. So we won't be getting sunset, but that's okay because this is cool too. Yeah. We're at Mad River Glen. It's not that cold out here. It's kind of cold. I, this, I, I was saying this is like the coldest night. Look at that fog like rolling through the with trees. the trees it looks like robin hood could jump out at any moment he might this is cool <laughs> we're at the top of mount ellen cool. there's not much of a view it's just the sea left yeah and the steepness Green tunnel. 
all while it's drying. Okay. Me too. Somewhere up top of Lincoln Mountain. It's been a soggy, damp morning, but it's really actually nice. It's really nice to feel like you have some sort of air conditioning system keeping you cool. I'm like a pug dog, I'm like a true pug, Just covered in mud. This might be the summit of Mount Lincoln. And now we have Mount Abe. We're at the summit of Mount Abraham. Should be a 360 degree view all around. As you can see, we're in one giant cloud. Cool thing though, much like Mount Musalaki, or Musalak. People have built up this little stone wind fortress. It's cool. cool. Yeah. Pug dog noticed this cool looking fungus growing up here on Mount Abe. <laughs> nice view. We're at the top of Mount Grant. Some nice views. I am hungry. And not just like a little bit hungry. It's dominated my thoughts all day long. I went with the Skarka recommendation of around 3,000 calories per day. Let me tell you day whatever this is into the hike is not enough 641 walking to camp on top of some mountain we did it we pulled off a 20 miler from stark's nest which is a warming hut at mad glen And we're heading to Emily Proctor. It's a big day, I feel good. Pug dog said she feels good. 